It is bat tag, bat tag time. Hey everybody, so you know what time it is. I don't, that was a crappy jingle, I'm sorry. <laughs> I need something. Anyway, bat tags, let's get them open. Let's see what we got. All right, so in the first envelope, we got a little card here. Aw, it says no peeking. That's really cute. Okay. Oh, a letter. And the pack tag envelope. Okay, let's see what the letter says. Ah! Jamie, I don't have pack tags of my own, but I would like to trade for one of yours. Enclosed is one of my... It was one of the neatest ones I've ever seen. Maybe I only think so because I'm a Doctor Who fan. I really need to watch that show. I feel like I'd like it if I just watched it. I just need to do it. Um, I really enjoy your videos, including the unboxings. Awesome. That's good to hear people like other videos that aren't just geocaching. Uh, I look forward to each month to the monthly boxes I get, and it's almost as enjoyable seeing what you get in your boxes. The only thing that would be better is being able to taste those treats. Man, they're pretty good for the most part. Uh, I've taken my dog Dudley geocaching. He's about the same size as Percy. I guess you found out that there are some castes you just don't go after with the pet along. For sure. Um, my wife usually comes along to watch Dudley while I do the cache hunting. Percy's really good about if I walk one direction to go a completely different direction when there's a bunch of trees. Really good about <laughs> wrapping me up around some trees. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. If you don't mind me asking, I'm curious about your relationship with Rory. I see him in so many of your videos, but he hardly speaks. Is he a relative or a colleague? Uh, so I'll answer that because a lot of people ask about who Rory is. Uh, Rory is my boyfriend. He is the reason why I live in Georgia right now. We met seven years ago? God, has it been that long? I don't know. Um, it's been a long time. Uh, but I used to live in Pennsylvania. Now I live in Georgia. We met playing a video game. Counter-Strike. Um, but yeah, so, and he doesn't talk much because... I do too much of the talking, so that's kind of why we work well together. But he does talk. Like, if you get him talking, it's hard to get him to stop talking. Uh, so, heads up if anybody meets him. It's hard to break conversation from once he gets going. <laughs> so, anyway. I love you, Rory, if you watch this. Um, uh, if you are going to MOGA, I may see you there. Ah! I'm not going to MOGA. There's so many events I want to go to. Uh, I did just get started on this whole geocaching thing. Maybe in the future I will be able to go to more and more events and hopefully make videos of them and get to meet everybody that watches my videos because that would be the best. That would honestly be even better reason why to go is to meet everybody that watches these videos. Alright, so let's see what you gave me for a pet tag. Uh, get out of the bag. Okay, so... Okay, you're not kidding. This is a very neat pat tag. Uh, it's Doctor Who with a cross with uh, Dr. Seuss. So, happy uh, holidays. This is very cute. So, I love these crossover type. I usually like even t-shirts and stuff to have like a crossover theme. So, it's cool to see pat tags are doing the same. But, yeah, you see like the Doctor Who TARDIS. You see the Grinch and uh, Cindy Lou. Was that her name from The Grinch Who Stole Christmas? I can't remember, but I'll let you guys see it. Mm, hopefully that focused enough. That's a very cool Doctor Who, Doctor Seuss crossover pet tag. Oh, uh, I didn't even say who this was from because your address is on here. Uh, thank you very much, Al Van Dyke, Uncle Cashier. What a cool name. Uh, I will definitely send you one of my pet tags. I will do that right after I'm done filming this video. Okay, time for another pet tag. No tape's going to stop me today. Alright, another little card. A thank you card. It says, thanks. Hi Jamie, here's my H-N-A-G pet tag. You can send me, send mine, yours, uh, to, okay. Oh, Brent Smith, okay. Oh, can't, Brent, I don't, I guess I forgot you were in Canada. But yeah, I'll definitely send you my pet tag. Uh, he also, if anybody checks him out, he also makes YouTube videos. I can't think offhand what your channel's under. It's either under Brent Smith, or maybe if you look up Sim Rebel, S I M R E B E L. Uh, he makes some videos too. Holy cow, Brent, this tape, you. <laughs> Guys, look what he did. I can't, I can't even. Alright, gonna have to do some surgery. Ah! Alright, making progress, making progress. Now let's try to get it out of the bag. Okay, so. That H N A G is a, I, guess, I think it Brent runs it. It's a Facebook page. I'm gonna jack this up, and I'm gonna try to do my best to say this. 
Hall Demand Norfolk Area Geocachers. So even if you go to Facebook and type H-N-A-G, uh, the Hall Demand Norfolk Area Geocachers should come up. Uh, if you go like their page, there's a bunch of other geocaching YouTube videos on there. So uh, if you like watching geocaching videos and you want another place to try to maybe find some people you haven't seen their videos of yet, um, yeah, check out that Facebook page. All right, Brett, what'd you send me? Do, do, do. Okay. So here's the thing. If I did jack up how to say it, it is written right on this path tag. It is very tiny, though, so maybe the camera will focus it enough to where you guys can all read it. So here's uh, Brent's pet tag. All right, that is Brent's pet tag. Uh, Brent's also the one that got me interested in rescuing pet tags that were sitting out in the wild for a long time, um, which now Project GC has taken that over. I haven't found any close enough to me yet to uh, rescue any, but if you guys found any pet tags that you're like, man, where is it? Why is nobody moving this along? You could go to Project GC and, um... oh, lost the pet tag. You can go, sorry, you can go to Project GC and, you know, find out how to put your pad tag on there so if somebody is in the area where it was last seen, they can go check the geocache and let you know if it's still there or not. If it's still there, they'll move it on. All right, oh, okay, so I know who this one's from and the tape. So, John, as you guys have heard me talk about before, Arlington Trains, who sends me lots of pad tags, uh, he showed me a couple more and I was like, yeah, I, need, I don't have those. So I think that's what these are. Is notorious taping them together. <laughs> All right, let me get these apart. All right, he sent me two owl pad tags, which is cool because uh, uh, I think owls are neat. So here's one. All right, there is one of the owl pad tags. Whoa! <laughs> All right, this one's really cute too. Uh, again, more owls, huge eyes. Uh, it reminds me of those toys I've seen recently. Um, I think I saw some at Hallmark. Owls with big, big eyes. And uh, it's got a lot of stars. Oh, it's actually from the same person. I guess that person likes owls. Alright, that is the other owl pad tag. And there's a whole lot going on in that one. But it's super pretty. Alright guys, so as always, thank you so much for the pad tags that everybody sent me. And I love the letters. I really do. I enjoy reading them. I like answering your questions and all that stuff. Um, but... Uh, so as always, if you want to send me a pet tag, uh, my P.O. box will be in the description below. Just go ahead and send me one of yours, with a letter preferably, tell me about the pet tag, and uh, I'll send you back one of mine. Uh, I still have plenty, so those of you that are making some, again, should still have some by the time um, you know you finally get yours made, send it to me. So whenever, uh, I am trading a lot on pattags.com, so if anybody else is getting interested in pet tags, you could also go to pattags.com. And you can trade for pat tags on there. Okay, so anyway, I gotta go. I gotta go mail out some pat tags to some awesome people that just sent me theirs. So until next time, I will see you guys later. Bye!